All right, this is Fable Anniversary, and arguably this is the best Fable in the series, which I'm not sure is entirely a good thing, considering you want a series to improve as, you know, it gets subsequent releases over the years. Me, personally, uh, I, I really do love uh, Fable 2 and Fable 1. Uh, Fable 3 is okay, but I am looking forward to having the excuse to play the original Fable, and... It's right now, I got my press copy. Um, it'll be Monday before I can post this. I'll probably wait till midnight. I usually wait till midnight anyway. But, um, Fable Anniversary, we're going to start a new game. And, let's see, so we key, blah, blah, blah. I don't think Fable One's that that long, if I can, if I recall correctly. Um, it's been many a year since I played the original Fable, but you know, uh, I don't think it's too terribly long. Do we want me to press A, or are we just loading? My my, there we go. Deep in the forest of Albion lay the small town of Oakvale, unchanged by time and untouched by the sword. Here lived a boy and his family, a boy dreaming of greatness, of one day being a hero. Sometimes he imagined himself as a noble knight or a powerful wizard. And other times, he dreamt he'd be an evil warrior. But in all his dreams of greatness, he could not possibly imagine the power of the destiny that lay before him. Come on, wake up. Ah, Don't yes, humble again, beginnings. Mind. Just like your mother, mind always wandering. Well, let it wander off to find your sister, will you? She's out playing by the Barrow Fields gate. Remember, you haven't given her a birthday present yet. Don't tell me you forgot to get her one. Well, I'm not bailing you out this time, son. Hmm. I'll tell you what, I'll give you a gold piece for each good deed you do around Oakvale. That should be enough to buy her a present. Now, get moving and stay out of trouble. This game actually looks really damn good. In all honesty, I haven't really been keeping up with it, but it looks good. I've lost Rosie. I left her, and I can't remember where. Her stuffing needs changing today, and I can't find her. Please help. She's a lovely little furry bear with a blue patch on her back. Let's see, uh... Okay, yeah, he'll give good deeds for what we do. Looks good! Um, I wonder if... I, I heard they spent quite a bit of time on remaking this. It wasn't just a simple... Oh, my little pumpkin. Oh, you're You're so naughty! <laughs> what? Uh, I, I was just... Um, I, I've never even met this woman. Who is she? Look, Sonny, keep your mouth shut about this, right? My wife's at home with our little ones, and I'm supposed to be working. But a man should be entitled to do what he likes, don't you think? Tell you what, if you keep this little secret, I'll give you a gold piece. Just don't tell my wife. I can't let her find out about this. Oh, come here, my little sand goose. Okay, yeah, we're gonna be a uh, goody two shoes. I mean, why not? Mind how you go, kid. This game looks really good. Hello, lad. I'm a trader. I wander the world buying and selling wares, especially to find folk like your good self. Some little girl I saw said you have a sister, and it's her birthday. 
And it seems you haven't got her a present yet. It just so happens that I have a rather nice box of sweets here. Guaranteed to put a smile on any sister's face for only three gold pieces. Maybe later, but hurry before I eat them myself. Remember, three gold coins, that's all they cost. It's all they cost, Stop you little street urchin. Let's Just see. like his mother can't keep still. Where's that filthy layabout husband of mine? <laughs> With some woman, I don't doubt. I run his house, bring up his children, and what do I get in return? Nothing. If you find him, let me know, won't you? Um, well... You have? Right. I'm gonna turn him into balverine food. Thank you, young sir, for telling me. Yay, a good deed. It just goes to show that good deeds never go unpunished, maybe. Oh, oh, thank goodness. Listen, lad, could you do me a favor? I've got to, you know, answer a call of nature. Oh, stay here and watch this stock for me. There's a good lad. Just stand between those two stacks and don't move. I'll put a good word in for you when I get back. Right, won't be long. Um. My cousin says that the barrels in these warehouses might have stuff in them. Quick, while he's away, smash his barrels up and see what's inside. Unless you're too scared. Unless you're just a big blubbing girl. Come on, let's go and break stuff. Are you just gonna stand there like a lemon? Yes, I'm going to stand oh, here like a lemon. So boring. Can I Would kill you? Would you prefer to be smashing things? I would prefer to be smashing you Come in the on. face. Come on, there's still time before he gets back. Oh, God. Oh, you're no fun at all. <clears throat> hmm. Fine, have your stupid good deed then. Okay, I will. Excellent, thanks, lad. You've done me a big favor. I'll let your dad know what a splendid watchman you made. See if there's anything around. It has been ages since I played Fable, so I really don't remember what's around. Okay, um, we need to find that little girl's, um, watch my jiggle. Stupid little idiot. Get him off me! Please help! He goes around the town beating up anyone smaller than him. But you look strong. I bet you could scare him off for good. I'm sorry. I'll leave him alone. Just please don't hit me again. Thank you. You stopped him good. Thank you. Here, I'll let you look after Rosie. She'll be safe with you. Whoa. We've done a good deed, we have, by Joe. Your face looks like Stonehenge. Come on, Rosie. Let's change your stuffing. As she stares into our very soul. Hello, 
little brother. I hope you haven't forgotten what day it is, like you did last year. I'm sorry if I woke you up last night. It was another of those dreams. I was standing in this field when something happened, but I can't remember what. Never mind that, though. I'm still waiting for my present. Okay, so... Hmm. We'll go talk to our father. He'll give us some gold coins. We'll go get the box of chocolates, give it to her. Watch our entire family and village get burned to the ground in a horrible slaughter that kills so many innocent people except for us, which we will go away on an adventure afterwards. It'll be fun. Well done, lad. Here's your reward for those good deeds. Well, I think you may have enough there, son. Have you spoken to the trader? Well, I will now. Ooh, you're lucky I've still got these sweets. Quickly, give me three gold pieces now, and they're yours. Young sure. sir, they are yours. Wish your sister a happy birthday from me now, won't you? chocolates it's just like my dream well, that was all he was really offering come on let's go home mother will be back for my party any minute now wait there's something wrong bandits <laughs> Evil had come to Oakvale. Bandits wielding torches and steel, slaying and burning all in their path. Blood red flames lit the night as the villagers screamed and begged for mercy, and soon their bodies filled the streets. Then the raiders reached the last house, where the boy and his family lived. It was them they had slaughtered so many to find. The father fought to protect his kin, but he was no warrior, and fell mortally wounded. The bandits ripped the house apart, but could not find the boy. Through torture and threats, his mother and sister remained silent, and their furious attackers took them both. From the nearby woods, the boy watched as all he knew was taken away. His whole life was crushed to ashes. He was alone. Yay, everyone's dead! And somehow we were able to stay completely safe by hiding behind a fence. Not very well, mind you, either. We were standing straight up gawking at the horror which was laid before us. On the plus side, this sets us up to be a hero! Woo!
There you go, Isaac Clark. <laughs> we must leave. It's not safe here. They're all dead. You don't want to join them, do you? Then give me your hand. So our little mute guy is, uh, well, he's just a sweet old thing, and someone's starting a car right outside my window. Huzzah. Hmm. I thought you'd have a stronger stomach than that. Come on. <sighs> Save your energy, boy. It's not me you want to fight. You might not realize it, but I just saved your life. There's nothing left for you in Oakvale. And if you'd stayed, you'd be as dead as the rest of them. Come with me. My name is Maze, and I'm the head of the Guild of Heroes. You must have heard of it. You'll find nowhere safer in all of Albion, nor a better place to call your home. And if it's vengeance you want, you'll need the training only we can offer. Here we are. I'll introduce you to the Guildmaster. He'll be your guide from now on. Hmm, well. Yay, we're hero now. Whoa. I have a new student for you. Put him in the dorm upstairs, with the girl. You don't look much like hero material to me, but Maze knows what he's doing, I suppose. Well, follow me then. You'll be sharing this room with Whisper, one of our brightest young pupils. She's playing in the woods right now but you'll meet her in the morning. For now, you should get some sleep. Your training starts tomorrow. <laughs> it's time to wake up. You must be my roommate. Hmm. Shorter than I expected. My name's Whisper. I've been here for a month. Had the room to myself till now, too. But that's all right. You know you talk in your sleep. Sounded like a bad nightmare. Happens to a lot the first week. Some don't even last that long. You won't either if you don't get moving. The Guildmaster is waiting for us in the map room. You don't want to be late on your first day. Follow me. Hmm. Looks like the Guildmaster got tired of waiting for you. He's probably at the training grounds across the river. Let's go! Okay, well, we'll go to the training grounds. This is the guild shop. When you're older, you can buy stuff here. When, yeah, older and perhaps have more than one gold piece. You've finally prized yourself from your pillow, I see. Over, yep. come on then. Let's see what you're capable of. You know my entire family in Village Are you ready? brutally murdered, right? You know, just throwing it out there. All right, lad. It's time to see if you've any potential. 
Get in the ring. Now then, I want you to hit that dummy as hard as you can. Just keep going till I tell you to stop. You're not making much of an impact there, are you? Here, try with this. That's more like it. When you destroy an enemy like this dummy, it drops an experience orb. These orbs contain the knowledge gained from killing the creature. It's very important that you collect these orbs, or you won't learn anything. Now pick it up. Wait, so that thing was alive? Well done, lad. Now then, tomorrow we'll... That's the guild alarm. Sounds like there might be something loose in the woods. This is a good opportunity to test your spirit. I'll wait for you at the Guildwood's entrance while you deal with the problem. Once you're done, we can talk about starting your training. You know, what if it's a Balverine, maybe? You know, large creature wants to eat people's faces. Balverine, it's kind of like a werewolf, except with more Balver. Mm, listen, I have to make an apple pie for the guildmaster at the end of the week. But I can't find any more red apples. I only need another four. If you find enough, can you bring them back here? I'll reward you. Yeah, sure, why not? The more apples, the, the merrier, I always say. over here we're discussing whether I'm the fastest apprentice in this guild I ran to the demon door and back in 50 seconds beat that right then get to the demon door and back and talk to me in 50 seconds Well, so far it hasn't made me stop to do an expression. I haven't got caught on the geometry yet, so that's good. I'm not sure if I'll make it. That's amazing! How did you do it? I lost my bet. Yep. Yeah. You lost. Well, life sucks sometimes. That showed you, didn't it? I don't think there's anything we can really do there yet. I don't know how he did it! Don't know how I did it. I used my feet. It's not that like complicated. Used my feet, got my well, got stuck on the geometry a few times. An apple. another Maybe there's one over here Hmm, we 
gonna need one more apple. I would really like to quit getting stuck on that series of rocks right there. That would be lovely, you know. Whatever floats your boat, I suppose. Again, still really like the game. We need an apple. A kingdom for a freaking apple. I got three of them. I need four. Here, apple, apple, apple. Face the truth. You are that quick. Where is that damn apple? Come on. Is it over there? No. Ah, oh, there we are. Oh, and there's a metric ass load of them this way. Well, live and learn. Live and learn. apples for me yet thanks thank you so much the guild master will get his pie here have this i give you apples and you give me a blueberry pie hmm if we can't real quick since i see a green circle Might be missing something here. Ah. The journey's length is of no consequence. The Oracle must be protected. How can you be so sure? We might need you here. Who knows what battles we might face? The signs are too strong to ignore and the Northern Wastes have been too long isolated from the Guild. There is much I may learn there. Well, I hope nobody thinks you're running away from a fight, trying to cheat death again. You know how people talk. Talk is of no matter to me. May death close his eyes to you, Maze. What are you waiting for? Come in. That was Scythe. He was a great hero once, back when he had flesh on his bones and blood in his veins. He's just a shell now. What does he know of the choices we have to make, of what it takes to get things done? Okay, so, did that. Now we can go do that mission. If I'm not the fastest, I must be the best at something. You are the best at complaining. Well, now that could be me. You haven't killed all the beetles yet. You can't expect to train as a hero if you can't deal with a few insects. Again, could be Balverines.
See, we've got to kill the beetles. There's a joke in there somewhere. These are big ass beetles. Sweet. Good work, lad. Those beetles can be a damn nuisance. Here, I think you've earned yourself some pocket money for that. If you want more gold, I'm sure the servants could use your help with something. Or you can get an early night. <laughs> 